Jonathan Bassine and JD Rogers, both all the way from Music City. Boys, how did you come from Music City to the Northland? Tell me a little bit about your journey here. Our assistant coach, new, uh, first year at Vandy, we were talking to him early in the fall about, or at least for me, about here coming to Northwoods. Just a really good league. And then Jonathan was actually a late add on. And I was like, hey, like, we got another roster spot. We'd love to have you. And, you and I are already having a great bond from this past year. And Jonathan, for you, the storyline has obviously been a little bit different. You had some playing time, some of collegiate baseball under your belt. So how have you gone ahead and translated that here at Wade Stadium? It's more of an approach thing than anything. Um, seeing, you know, the best arms in the country throughout the SEC. Um, obviously, you face the best of the best. You come here and you just want to translate it as best as you can. And as you guys know, I'm sure, being recruited to play at Vanderbilt, it's no secret that it breeds MLB players and that culture that you guys create. So what has that been like, playing with that kind of talent and that level? It's, it's unbelievable. The development that we get through the program uh, with the coaching staff, they spend so much time with you, just developing you into the best, not only the best person you can be, but the best baseball player. And you guys talk about a lot of detail-oriented things that stand out in the program that you're at down in Nashville, but how have you been able to bring that culture and those things here to continue to refine your craft in summer? Because it really is all about you as individuals. You come here with a group of strangers to just become better baseball players. You know, I think it's, I think it's special. I think it's really cool to be able to bring different cultures from different teams together and put them all into one team, one environment. Pivoting on over, a little rapid fire for you guys. Since you've been to Duluth, what is the best thing that you've done with a little bit of your off time that you've had? Uh, so far, I haven't, I haven't had an off day since I've been here, so uh, I'm, no looking forward to, I'm looking forward to it in the upcoming week. How about favorite restaurant? You know, we went to one today, it was pretty good. Sammy's? Yeah, we Sammy's. Sammy's Pizza? Yeah. yeah. Really um, good, really, really yeah, good. Yeah, like a little buffet action from 12 to 2. You can just so eat we were as much as you good. want. Yeah. Car blown because and it was game after, day. It was after a lift, too, so I just, it was, I, good. It was good. It was been pinned, I heard earlier, as the squirrel and the golden retriever. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's more of a the personality aspect. Uh, I, I tend to get them all over the place. Uh, little little twitchy, little, you know, I, I get, I get very energetic and then, you know. Being here, I mean, again, you come in a group of strangers and you're expected to perform and exceed expectations, win. I mean, the list goes on. So how have you surprised yourselves individually and as a team? Well, for me, is it's more of like, it's a big test uh, to come all the way to Minnesota. You're leaving your family, you're leaving, you're leaving your loved ones after a long season, be able to you know, bring your personality and bring like almost a light in the room and like to be able to be like a bright personality. And that's kind of what I, I strive for no matter what happens in the game. I just try to be as, as vibrant as I can. So I got this term I always use. It's called, a, it's the Hawaii vibes only. <laughs> so it's uh, when we went to Hawaii, uh, as a team, we probably played the most loose we've ever played when we went to Hawaii. So from then on, every time I'm ever, ever, I'm ever thinking anything or I'm thinking too much, I go to my Hawaii vibes, which is just go have fun. It's a nice day out. Go play some baseball. Are you going to catch you wearing some lays out there tonight? Yeah. <laughs> would you be surprised? You, you would wear it. He came into the locker room a couple of days with his, like this is four weeks after we went to Hawaii. No, this was way, this was like end of the season. Yeah, end of, yeah, end like, of the season. End of the season. I walk in, your... I walk in with my Oakley's on and my, my Hawaii t-shirt I bought. And, and it's just, and we won that day. Everybody loves to be in Hawaii. I mean, That's very much. That, that, that they make a good point. We played really, really, really we well did. in Hawaii. We did. We well, did. Hopefully you guys can create your Hawaii here tonight. Jonathan, JD, I appreciate your time. Thank you guys very much. Thank, Thank you. you. I appreciate it.